Hi, YouTube. YouTube, welcome back to another video. So some of you might know this, some of you might not, but the Australian Open is a Grand Slam and these tournaments are just bigger, they're more exciting, there's more money put into the tournaments, there's more pressure involved on the tournaments, the tournaments are longer, usually in a really cool location and this is definitely one of the, I think, cooler, they're all really special in their own right. This is definitely one of my favorites just because Australia is so amazing. It's summer in Australia right now and the people are really nice, the food is really good and fresh here. And yeah, just like a lot to be excited about. It's the beginning of the season. All these guys sort of get a fresh start here. But anyways, I'm really just excited to be here if you can't tell. Um, so I'm gonna be vlogging fully the tournament, which I'm really excited about. I'm doing a lot of partnerships at this tournament, which is really fun. I have a lot of plans for the Grand Slams this year and just like tennis partnerships in general. So I'm gonna be vlogging all of that like tournament tennis stuff, like tennis fashion stuff when the tournament starts in the 15th. So we're here like a few days before the tournament. So this vlog's just gonna be a more, just settling in at the house we're renting, a little chill vlog. I have an event that I'm going to on Sunday that I'll vlog. So yeah, I'm excited for this week's vlog. It's always really nice to get to these tournaments and we normally do get to them before the tournament starts so you can just like really enjoy the place and all that. So I've just showered, done my skincare routine, unpacked, and now Tommy's going to get here any second. I'm really excited to see him. We're gonna run to the tournament site. So the players actually practice on site like all week up until the tournament starts. So Tommy has practice and I have to grab my credentials so I'm gonna go with him. And then I'm planning on getting dinner or drinks with my girlfriend, Ian. She's another girlfriend on the tennis tour who's just awesome. I'm just waiting for Tommy. Now he's just getting back from the airport. He was at another tournament. for the tournament. I'm gonna eat something, so I'll show you guys the food court. It's usually pretty nice at the Grand Slam. I'm so hungry. Quickly applying just a little bit more makeup. I got really freckly today. Um, and then I'm gonna run out to dinner, so I'm excited about that. See how freckly I am? Sometimes I feel like it doesn't pick up how freckly I am. But I'm just gonna put on some of this Amazon lip stain and then probably some lip gloss. Okay, just throw on some mascara, lip liner, and a little bit more blush. I'm just gonna wear a big jacket, I think. Big jacket and maybe like a pair of like lower heels. Okay, wearing the same little bodysuit that I wore today to the site. And then this big New Balance jacket, which is Tommy's. And then I just put on a pair of like black heels. I feel like this is like cute and sporty. Also, I got this Fendi little like vintage Fendi purse from Revolve. Revolve does consignment stuff now, which I think is really smart. So. That's all.
done now to the South Melbourne market on our way back from the site yesterday I was telling Tommy how I wanted to go to the market to get stuff to like grill tonight for dinner Because we have like a kitchen and a grill and the woman driving was like, oh, you have to go to the South Melbourne market apparently it's Really cool and amazing and I looked it up and it looks really really cool I absolutely love going to markets when I'm in new places Melbourne is also a very culturally diverse place gonna run there try to get some stuff for dinner. I stole Tommy's jacket I don't know what this is um, But it's the same one that I wore last night but in a different Color I also did a, like a little bit of shopping this morning. I'll do a little haul for you guys, but I want to run out Now to the market and then we can do that haul later and then i'm gonna cook um so let's go Okay, here's a little haul of everything I got at the market. Funny enough, I'm most excited about this like salt. It was a spice store. I got this garlic salt and then I got just this like fancy coarse salt for the meat. Got some eggs for breakfast, dill, green onion, and cilantro. I'm gonna make like an herb salad tonight with some jalapeno cucumber. This lettuce, got some Tomatoes, got some fresh bread, lemons, strawberries, got this Australian olive oil, got some red potatoes for dinner, and then I got uh, some lamb chops and some steak. out of the shower and did a little bit of makeup i'm gonna let my hair dry air dry this morning because i have time we're just gonna go grab breakfast right now and i don't have that many plans for this afternoon there are a few stores that i might go into that dm me to come in so i might do that and then i don't really have a plan today um the matches start today it's sunday but tommy's not playing until tuesday so we have some free time, so I don't really know what I'm going to do today, but I'm really excited for breakfast. Breakfast in Australia is so good. The coffee is so good. I feel like the pancakes are really good. The pastries are really good. Also really exciting. I'm wearing uh, one of our new tops. We made the perfect waffle long sleeve. It has like florals on it and little details. So we have it coming out in this color and in white. Okay, this is all the stuff that I'm gonna be trying on. It's literally so cute. This is just so pretty. I will link their website and some of the pieces that I picked out because it's just so cute. Tommy is having people over. Are you stepping your team over? Yeah, looking like it. I'm, I'm actually going out to dinner tonight with my girlfriend, Hannah, who's another um, tennis girlfriend. I don't really love the word wag. Like, you can't call yourself a wag. You definitely cannot. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna help Tommy hook and get the meat ready. And she's gonna leave me. And then I'm gonna leave him. But I actually want to like help and cook and hang, but I do also want to go out to dinner. Um, so that's what we're doing. 
before dinner tonight, my friend Anna is also coming over. She is, I actually met her through Instagram during Wimbledon. Have I met her? Uh, I don't think you've met her. But she owns a vintage shop called Capri Vintage and she DM'd me during Wimbledon because she was living in London at the time and she let me borrow some really cute vintage pieces and we became friends and she's going to be helping me this week with some content stuff and she brought some clothes for me so I think we're gonna go through like the outfits that so I'm gonna be here? she moved to Sydney and she's here for like the week she was living in London now she's in Sydney We're just putting together some outfits. Yay! So I'm really exciting. excited. This is a really good thing to do if you're going on a trip. I feel like planning and taking a photo of what you're gonna wear. Yeah. Like I feel like I never do that, but it helps when you get dressed. Yes, yeah, so you don't forget. But you don't forget. Okay, vlog. I quickly just got ready for dinner. I'm feeling very Australian. It is from Kukai Australia. I picked it up today. It's a long skirt, and I feel like Australian girls wear skirts like this. I could be wrong. My sunglasses are from DNY. My dress is from Kukai, earrings are from Heaven Mayhem. I'm on this side of the car. <laughs> she comes to the car and tries to get in. Yeah, that's me, I'm like, get out. I'm driving. I love your accent so much. 24. <laughs> 24. I said, um, I, I, I said to someone, I, they go, where are you going? I go, Melbourne. And Tommy goes, what the what fuck? The fuck? <laughs> Melbourne. 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 <laughs> that's so Melbourne. Funny. Do I sound like I have an accent? Yes. 